everybody. So today's video is going to be my February favorites. Can you believe how fast February has gone by? Like, mind blown. Like, it's crazy how fast this year is, is going. Like, it's going to be March already. That's crazy. So yeah, February has come and gone. And I just want to talk about a few of my favorites this month. Um, so yeah, let's get started. So first, let's get started on some hair products. So lately, I've been loving the Garnier Fructis. Um, Marvelous Oil, Oil <laughs> Deep Nourish Hair Elixir. This is what it looks like. And I promise you, like this makes your hair just look so healthy. Like I had some damage from coloring my hair. This is all my natural hair color. So I haven't really colored my hair in a very long time. But I had some damage from coloring it before. I used to do ombre and all that stuff. So I, I decided for a year to let my hair just breathe and, you know, just let it be its own color. Um, and this has really, really, like, helped my hair just become more healthy and my split ends are like not even that bad anymore and this is really good what I do is I just put this on um, right after I shower and also I have curly hair so this actually helps with tangles and that's pretty awesome I'm sorry <laughs> these, I swear to you these allergies are so bad here in Austin Ugh, this weather in Texas is just mm. and now my sneeze went away Okay, <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Um, but yeah, this is a really good product to have if you have damaged hair, if you colored your hair a lot in the past. Um, and it's really, it smells really good and it feels really good in your hair and it makes your hair so soft. My husband's always like, oh, your hair's so soft. He's always like petting me like a dog or something because my hair's so soft. So it really does work. So yeah, you should try this. Okay, so next I'm going to go with skincare. Um, so one thing about my skin is I don't really suffer from acne. Um, but this past month has been so intense. So my husband got in a little uh, fender bender and the ladies insurance company was horrible and they were trying to make us pay for it and it was her fault and she said it was her fault and it was, there was just so much, like we had a rental car for like two weeks and it was just, oh, I was so stressed out. For like two weeks, I was like completely broken out. I literally had like pimples. You can probably see like right oh my gosh see like all this was like my problem area oh my gosh like I got so many pimples it was so insane so I started using Bior a uh, deep pore charcoal cleanser this is what it looks like this is amazing and let me just say I've tried higher end products like the Peter Roth cleansing a uh, purifying mask or the um the peel the chemical peel kind of stuff and that was like $50. This is like $7.99 at Target. And this stuff works probably better. And I'm so impressed with this. I literally started using this and like within two two times, like all my pimples dried up. I mean, they're still there, but they're not like there. And this is really, really good. And also I have like a peeling on my nose from like my allergies. And I had like a lot of dead skin around my nose, like right here. And I literally saw a difference with this within one use. Like, I had gone to Sephora and the lady told me, like, oh, you should get that Peter Roth stuff. It's it's expensive, but it's worth it and blah, blah, blah. And I used that one time and it, this did more. This took off more of my dead skin around my nose at $7.99 than the Peter Roth did at $50. So if you guys have dead skin or you, you guys want to just, like, clear up your skin, this bad boy is amazing and it's so cheap so I definitely recommend this one okay so the next product I want to talk about is the Garnier moisture rescue refreshing gel cream now this gel cream it's actually like amazing like it feels so good on your skin it's just like a little pink consistency it's like kind of it's kind of weird because you got to like dip your fingers in there and put it on your face but it's whatever but my skin is, I have dry skin, and this is for the dry skin. There's another green one, and that's for, I think, combination skin, if not oily skin. I think it's combination skin. But I decided to get the dry skin because during the winter, my skin gets crazy dry. And so what I do at night is I wash my face with this, and then once I rinse all it off, I just moisturize my face with this, and oh, my skin feels so soft. And yeah, this is a good little combination. So... A lot of times I break out with certain products. Like I know with Clean and Clear, a couple of them break me out. Um, and I know Aveeno is good and so is uh, St. Ives is good. But these these two together, for if you have dry skin, it definitely, it definitely helps and it definitely works. Okay, so next is an oldie but a goodie. I have been obsessed with my Clinique Happy. 
This is Clinique Happy. I have been using this since high school. And this is this is just my scent. And I have allergies, like I say all the time. Um, as you can hear, <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Um, but Clinique Happy, it never gives me allergies. Like there's certain perfumes that give me allergies and I just start sneezing right away. But this is like perfect. And this is probably like my sixth or seventh bottle. This is the only perfume that if you ever want to buy me perfume, this would be the perfume to buy me because I love this and it's like an obsession. It smells so good. I'm just going to spray it right now because I love it so much. You guys, if you don't, if you've never smelled this, you need to smell it. It's just so floral. It doesn't have a description. It's just so floral and just so clean and just, oh. this is it right here. You need to try this ASAP. So next, let's get started on some makeup. I am going to start with lippies first. I love lipstick. Lipstick is everything. I, if I don't have any makeup on and I have lipstick, I'm fine. That's just how it is. I just, I love lipstick. So I want to get started with the basics. My baby lips. I love baby lips. It's just like a clear, you know, a clear baby lip. <laughs> um, I just love this. I put this on every morning, every night. And it's SPF 20, so it really helps with, you know, the sun. I mean, there hasn't been any sun lately because it's been so dang cold. But in Texas, it's important in the summer to have sunscreen. The next product I want to talk about is my lip liner. I love lip liners. I love lip liners. So um, this one, oops, I think I broke it. Oh, no. <laughs> this was from the Flower line, um, the Flower Cosmetics. This one is called, uh, da, 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 da. it's called Plum. Oh my gosh, it's a little messy. But as you can see, it's a really, really pretty plum color. Um, I wear this all the time. This is such a pretty color. The Walmart I go to doesn't have it, but I think I'm gonna start buying it online because I really like her stuff. And this is so cute. The packaging is so cute. This is the Revlon Color Stay in Mauve. It's just like a really pretty mauve color, a really pretty brown color. I love, I've always loved the mauve color. I, I'm not, I'm not gonna sit here and say, oh, it's because of Kylie Jenner. No, girl. This color was rocked by my little family for a very long time. So I grew up in a Latin household with my sister rocking like brown lipstick. I listened to Selena, you know what I'm saying? Like I love dark brown lipstick and mauve colors. So I've been loving these colors since I was little. And this is like my absolute favorite. It stays on your lips. It stays for a while. More. This one has more brown undertone. It's so pretty, as you can see. Let me show you. So you see there, it can, there we go. So it's like a really pretty pinkish. It's just so, it's so, it's a romantic color. So I love this color. Okay, so next, let's talk about the face a little bit. Um, I love this Instant Age Rewind um, Concealer. I have mine in Neutralizer. And it's just this, you know, I'm pretty sure you've seen it. Everybody has it on YouTube. Everybody uses this. This stuff is amazing. It really is because it's cheap and it does the job. So I'm not one to really spend money on high-end products. Like the only high-end product I have, I'll show you right now in a little bit. But I really don't use a lot of high-end products. I just can't wrap myself around spending like $40 on a concealer. Um, I'll stick with the $7.99. <laughs> so... I love a good highlight. I, I love it. I, I think it makes your face glow and it just looks really pretty. So I'm going to show you something that's top secret. Okay, not really, but I'll let you know. <laughs> um, so, ooh, I almost dropped it. That wouldn't have been good. So like I said, I don't like spending money on like high-end products. And this one's actually, I broke, I broke the top. But this one's from e.l.f. It's Baked Blush. And this is what it looks like. And I am telling you, like, I know there's a lot of, like, high-end products that, like, like, Bobbi Brown or, um, the other girl, the Becca highlighter and all that stuff that costs crazy money. And you want that highlight, but you don't want to spend the money. Girl, I feel you, because that's how I am. I don't, mm-mm, mm, -mm, mm -mm, don't come at me with that. I don't want to spend money. Sorry, YouTubers. You can see, I have, you see the highlight right there? Like, that's what I have on. Like, I don't know if you can see this one because of the shadow. But like this one right here, you can see the highlight with the sun move, boop, 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 right there. So this one is what I have on. And this is $3. It's called Pinktastic. It's called Pinktastic. And look how pretty this is. Like it's just like a beautiful shimmery color. Like it's insane. 
And it does the same thing. Like, let me swatch it a little bit so you can see. Look at that. That is amazing. Like, the way it looks on the skin, like, look at that. You see that shimmer? You don't need to spend $50 on no highlighter. Look at that. That's amazing. And it does the job. It, as you can see, clearly, I have like a highlight right here going on. And it's just so pretty. Like, oh my gosh. When I, when I figured out that I can use this as a highlighter, I went crazy. I was like, oh my gosh, I am so excited. Okay. Oh, I fixed it. Yay. <laughs> I'm so excited. And yeah, so this is the e.l.f. Baked Blush. It's the e.l.f. Baked Blush in Pinktastic. So they have it on e.l.f.com or Target. I'm sure they have it. So yeah, you guys should definitely check this out and use it. Use it. <laughs> And use it for a highlighter. It's amazing. Okay, so the last makeup product I want to talk about is my high-end, I guess, makeup, whatever. <laughs> it's my high-end product. And I got this for Christmas for my husband, and it's the Naked 2 palette. Oh my gosh, like, I am so obsessed with it. So, of course, you know what the Naked palette looks like. You've seen it before. And, um, yeah, I decided to go with the Naked 2 because I didn't really like the Naked 3 and the Naked 1, I was like, eh, it's cool. But the Naked 2, and I like the casing. It's just so, like, cool, you know? So, yeah, this bad boy, I use it all the time. But, um, yeah, this is, like, the only thing I've gotten expensive. And I'm just so cheap. But this is this was actually worth it, I'm telling you. If you're, if you're frugal like I am and you don't want to spend the money, this is definitely worth it. So, and this was, I think, 42 54 golly I don't remember but it was around 40 to 55 price range but you get so many colors and they last longer and like the pigmentation is ridiculous so you don't have to use that much I know with like some hard candy or Revlon you gotta like really like go in there and like you know rub it rub it rub it so it can get on your so it can get on your on your on your finger and this you're just like boop whoa it's insane so this is a really good bargain in the sense of like it has a lot of different colors and it's pretty and who doesn't like pretty? I think as women, everybody should have one of these. Whether it be one, two, or three, this is a definitely a staple in your makeup. Okay, so moving on away from the makeup and all that, I just wanna talk about how much I love my iPad. I am obsessed with my iPad. I got this for my birthday in October last year and I just, I'm obsessed with it. Like I have my little cover on it right now and I just, I'm always on Pinterest. Like, if you have Pinterest, follow me because I'm always on Pinterest. And I just like like playing games here. Like, I have like word search and heads up and stuff. Um, but I'm obsessed with this. So moving along with my iPad accessories, what I recently got was this really, really cool keyboard. And basically it's a Bluetooth keyboard and you just like connect your iPad on there or even your iPhone. So it becomes a case. So you have the iPad and you have this in the front. And I also insert a video of how it looks when you type. It's so cool. So yeah, and that was, I got it on Groupon for like, I think $17. So it's a really good deal. And I really, really like it. So I can type and do whatever I need to do with my iPad. I also got uh, the Hanks Writer. It's an app by Tom Hanks, who's like one of my favorite actors. And it's just so cool. Yeah, so you just like type on there. It even makes like the noises. It's so cool. You see? I don't know. I'm a nerd. I like that kind of stuff. So yeah, that's all I have for my February favorites. It's crazy how fast this year has gone by and how fast February has gone by. But I am so excited for March and for the hotter weather to come around and this cold weather to stop so I can feel better and not be sick all the time. That's all I have for you today. And don't forget to subscribe and follow me on my, my social media. And yeah, I hope you guys have a great, great day. And yeah, bye.